Hello you guys, this is B Madness. Um, I'm here to show you how to duplicate chests if you would like a lot of chests and also how to make really easy money while doing it. First you will need a, doesn't have to be superior, but an ice rod. You can get that for, I mean not for, from the wizard or if you have a generous friend who's willing to give it to you at a price or for free. It cost one platinum, one of these, and if you do have one but you don't know how to get enough money for it, I'm actually going to show you how to get it, or not how to get platinum, but how to get enough for it. As you see right here, I have 97. Okay, so what you would need is, you would need an ice rod, oh, one more thing, a... A hammer of any kind. Mine is a hamdrax. Okay, so just yeah, I have like the ones right there, so I got her. Um, go up here. Let me get my chest. You have to have a chest to start out with, too. Okay, you are going to get it. You're gonna get an item, any kind of worthless item that you can get. I'm gonna use an arrow because. Arrows are really easy to make. Um, then I'm going to use my ice rod in the left corner. And see how it's got three for it? Now, if you get your hammer and stuff, you can just keep on doing this. And stuff. Whoops. All right, hold on, wait one second. Yeah, minor difficulties. Okay, um, so yeah, ice rod, melee hammer, and stuff, and just keep on doing this. All right, now let's go sail. I only have a few though, but yeah. You can go to anyone. I'll just go to my tailor right here. Um, a sack of 99 is 9 gold, 90 silver. You can go over. You, you can sell them. And you can keep on doing this over and over and over. And stuff. You can keep on doing this over and over. And if your friend has a valuable item that you would like, and he's offering it at a price. That's a really good way how to get a lot of money and not tell them. So you can actually get stuff from them. Alright, see how like right here? This money right here, I actually just got just from doing that. 10 platinum, 56 gold in here. So now I have 14 platinum, 6 gold, 20 silver, and 18. And if you guys think that, because if you have one platinum coin... You could probably buy anything at any kind of price because you could buy anything for gold, you could buy anything for silver, and you could buy anything for platinum because it actually goes and goes into whatever you're trying to buy. So yeah, it's really good. And I'm also going to show you another thing. You guys might think the bell is kind of worthless, but actually, if you can get... Let's see here. Well, I'm going to show you how you can get it. You get it from the wizard, once again. If you get the wizard, you can probably do a lot of things. You get the wizard, you buy a bell. It costs one gold, right? Then, you're going to need to collect some of these things. I'm actually not going to show you how to make the bell, because I actually don't have the supplies for it. It takes some. Here, let me do it a little bit better. Sorry, guys. I'm not like that really prepared for this. Um, you go to the... What is this? The guide. You go to crafting. You go to the bell. And this is what it takes. It takes one bell, 80 pixie dust, 15 souls of light, 15 gold bars, and 20 souls of sight. And please, if you guys see this, I actually do not know how to get the souls of sight. Um, that's the only thing I need and stuff. Uh, but yeah, I have all of this. I even have 80 pixie dust. But if you guys are willing to, can you guys like leave a comment about how to get souls of 
a slight. Also, if you guys um, like my armor, it's actually not what you think it is. I'm actually wearing dragon armor. This is actually a really good combo right here. Um, if you also have wild rocket boots, you can make you can make it so you can go higher with wings. Doesn't have to be demon. It could be any kind of wings. Um, if you have the spectral armor or and stuff, best thing to be to use would have to be the bo um, bottom because it increases movement and magic damage too so it actually does three things pretty high in defense actually better than my dragon reavers because actually my dragon reavers only do 14 not that much only does 12 increased movement speed and 2 increased melee speed set bonus 21% increased melee and movement speed so yeah those are some few tips on how to make a fairy bell, which magically summons fairies for how about how much? I think 36 mana. Let me see here. Here, I'm just going to make this a little bit easier, guys, so it doesn't take forever. It... See, it uses 36 mana, summons a magical fairy, and it lasts for 5. Don't really know. I think it, I think it doesn't disappear because it doesn't say consumable. Mm -hmm. So, I think it lasts forever. You can summon the magical fairy for 5 minutes every time. And stuff, I doesn't say it does damage or anything and stuff but it I know it's one of the items so for the Xbox edition it is part of an achievement so yeah